floodlights are already on and the action will soon begin. We're at the Estadio de Balaidos. My name is Derek Ray and with me is my commentary partner Lee Dixon and action coming up from the Spanish top division La Liga. It's Celta Vigo and they take on Huesca. Thanks Derek. Well both managers will be reminding their players how important it is to get off to a quick start here. Attack the game from the off, impose your game plan and hopefully we get a good game. And here's how it looks for Celta Vigo. A standard 4-4-2, a formation you know well from your playing days, Lee. Yeah, I like this formation, Derek. It's very, very important that when they haven't got the ball, they all stick together. Very solid look about it. When they don't have the ball, very important that they stay close together in midfield. The back four will link across the width of the pitch, but they've got to help the forwards. The two up front need width. And so the initial 11 for Wesker. It does look as though they will mirror their opponents with a conventional 4-4-2 formation, Lee. Yeah, and when you go against a 4-4-2 and you're playing it yourself, you match up in midfield, and that's the important area. Sometimes when you play two midfield players, you can get outnumbered when a number 10 comes in between you, but it's not the case today. It's all about individuals against individuals. Who's going to come out on top? And the match begins. Bryce Mendes. And Santi Mina with it. Renato Tapia. Olasa. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Well, oh, they couldn't keep it. Chance to attack using wit. Cross could be useful. And the danger cleared. Denis Suarez. Santi Mina. Nolito now. Defence of Brazilians to shut them down. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Olasa. I do has it. Iago Aspas. Tapia on the ball. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Santi Mina, Iago Aspas, giving the ball away. Rafa Mir, and Maffeo on the ball. And he's allowed his opponent to get past him. Olasa. Nolito now. Iago Aspas. And unable to keep the ball. And a good looking ball. Opportunity it is. Oh, it was a crucial challenge. And now the delivery, able to deal with the threat. Real danger. And now they have the ball back. Renato Tapia. 
It's with Iago Aspas. Nolito. Tapia on the ball. Suarez. Giving it a try. And putting his body on the line. Well, they keep the ball moving. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, you could see it coming, Derek. They did a great job of moving the ball, pulling players out of position, and eventually found the space to finish it off. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Well, the manager's showing signs of frustration. They need to improve if they're going to get something out of this game, Derek. So the match has restarted. 1 0 here. Del Celta. Con el seis, Denis Suarez. Pulido. Rico. Siovas on the ball. And unable to keep possession. I do. Now this is Suarez. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Breaking at pace. Mosquera. Ontiveros. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Pulls it back. No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Well, here it is again. Lovely disguise on the cross. The pullback catches out the defenders. There's still a lot of work to be done, but the keeper presents the near post on a plate and he's punished. That's quite remarkable. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, there's never a bad time to score a goal, but just before half-time can be crucial. And he's got his team back in this game. What can he produce in the second half? Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Abby Galan. It's with Mikel Rico. Rafa Mir. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Thumped clear. Oh, a fine block. He's driven in the corner. Not messing around with that clearance. And a chance to whip it in here. Well, he went strongly into the challenge and the result is a throw-in. Ontiveros. And the cross smuggled away. Cross fired over. And clears his lines. Denis Suarez. Renato Tapia. Bryce Mendes. 
Now this is Suarez. Running with the ball confidently. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Mikel Rico. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. And they're making a change. Miguel Rico. Entrará en su lugar con el 21, Juan Carlos Real. I do. Tapia on the ball. Iago Aspas. Nolito. And Santi Mina with it. Nolito. Can he find the net? Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Well, we can see the stats. They don't lie. They haven't created enough chances today, but the quality in the end should pull them through in this game. Been frustrating for the fans, though. Ontiveros. That's excellent defending following the cross. Renato Tapia. Now this is Suarez. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Here it is now, a substitution. Pablo Maffeo. Juan Carlos with it. Ontiveros. Iago Aspas. Good defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Defenders need to cover. Pablo Maffeo. Space and time for the cross. And that's a straightforward stop. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Must take the lead here. And they do. And with so little time left, that will surely be decisive. Astonishing drama. Well, here's the replay. It's a gorgeous ball over the top and then through on goal. Do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Well, I think the coach can feel the game slipping away here. He's showing his frustration on the sidelines. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, still the prospect of late excitement in this match. Rafa Mir. Juan Carlos. Ontiveros. Well, do they have a goal in their future? They're giving it a go. They've won back possession. Just listen to the fans here, Derek. They've just kept their noses in front and these fans are doing their best to push them to the final whistle. Measured pass intended for Nolito here. He has time to play it over. And he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Cleared away. What can they do from here? And there goes the final whistle, and the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome, Lee. Wow, what a finish. The emotions will be running high right now on both sides. Euphoria on one, and total dejection on the other. Scintillating stuff, Derek. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple.